Hey guys, how's it going? Sexy Potato here. Um, so more Elden Ring. Uh, sorry about the quality of me talking this episode. Let's just say that I had to censor some stuff because of Daddy YouTube, as well as I just didn't really feel like talking when I recorded yesterday. So, yeah, so I hope you enjoy the- because I made a lot of progress, I hope you enjoy what I did. Who goes there? Carly sent you, did he? Never the bloody busybody. Hmm. Maybe to him you don't seem so strange. The name's Blythe. I'm looking for a man who goes by Darrowan. He fled somewhere nearby. Or so I've heard. Come tell me if you find him before I do. I can offer you ample reward. Sure, Blythe, I can do that. Darrowell is nothing but a traitor, and in need of a fitting end to his tale. Alright, I'll tell you where Darrowell is. Yeah, I'll tell you where he is indeed. Alright. Yeah, here's Blyde right here. Yeah. Luckily, though, I won't need him. I won't need him at all. Oh yeah, that's so fucking good. Darwell. Yeah, I'm a little rusty, but hey, I, I still killed him. That's all that matters. Anyway, what up, Blyd? <sighs> right. There you are. Not to work for it, but it's done. Don't say I'm not a man of my word. Here's your prize. Thank you. Uh, actually, I really do appreciate that. Thank you. Oh, yes. I should say, if you venture north to Rhea Lucaria and come across a venerable blacksmith who's a little on the large side, tell him I sent you, and he'll be sure to treat you right. I owe you one, I reckon. Alright. Thank you, Blyde. Yeah, yeah, I'll definitely remember that. Thank you. Speaking of ever jails, let's go ahead and uh, do this one real quick since we're here. Let's go ahead and get this buffed. Alright, let's do this. Oh, gotta eat the prawn. Prawn. Alright, time to die. Think I'm scared of you? actually pretty cool what I just did there. Oh, 
Whoa! Disrespect right there. Ooh. With the with my little dragon on my hand. I feel unstoppable. I know the weapon isn't really that good. Except for the thing is, is that uh, I just don't care. Oh, he's on the ground. Ah! Fart gas! Oh yeah, I bet you think you're so cool. Well, guess what I have? Fire! Fire! There we go. Fall nice and healed up. I know I shouldn't be using my flask of wondrous physics like that, but to be honest with you, I don't really care. Oh, great to me. He's clean rot, dude. Eat the prawn! Wait, they're weak to fire. Then why did I buff with the lightning? Oh, well. I mean, that guy did that fight sloppily, but hey, you know, slapping them around is kind of my thing. You know, honestly, I don't really care how bad the the Dragon Fist is. It's so cool. Um, Godric is honestly one of my favorite bosses of all Elden Ring, to be honest with you. Like, cause halfway through the fight, he chops off his hand and crafts the dragon on there. That's so cool. And I think it's pretty rad to have a dragon for my left hand. I think that's pretty cool. I don't care if it does less damage than just using those both ball fists, but I don't care. I like it, and I want to keep using it. Got heart dudes. That's okay, because I have a secret bomb to deal with these fart dudes. Bombs away, fart guy. Fartastic. The Crystal Tunnels. Yo, old man. Open. Somber Smithing Stones, nice. Nothing like a good old blunt weapon to make these stone guys fall over. That's not good. Got the eye. Ooh, I almost fell again. Not gonna lie, I'd be pretty upset if I fell again. Time to kill. I don't know why I'm using lightning, but. Yeah, just give me a second to buff up. Yep. 
broken yet. There we go. Oh, that was fantastic. Yeah, so after that mine incident, I think I went ahead and started doing the quest for Varage so I can get to a certain area of the game. A late game area, pretty early, which is pretty good for farming up runes and whatnot. So yeah, so I just have to get the trust of these blood cult guys. How hard could it be? And let me tell you, if you like PvP, it's probably pretty easy, but if you're like me, and you're not really that good, pretty rough but thank god I lost the footage I uh, no, no I actually lost the footage the game crashed when I was recording it so it corrupted the files so yeah I don't have any footage I was gonna show the footage but I don't have the footage thank god I don't because the PvP in this game is toxic insert that clip where it's me and my sister playing and that guy shot us with a cannon so yeah oh it's Vare hey Vare this is the guy that calls you maidenless at the start of the game. Ugh, let me move closer. Hello, Vare. Ah, there you are. You claimed a great rune and had your audience with the two fingers at the round table hole. What was your impression? Uh, they seem to be creepy to me. Aha. Uh -huh. Your intuition serves you well. My doubts had been piling up, you see. The words of the two fingers cannot be trusted. Truly, naught but rambling, senile delusions. I believe that when the Elden Ring was shattered, the two fingers were corrupted, their guidance skewed. Even worse, the fingers harbor no love for our kind. That's the part that irks the most. Yeah, I agree. Oh, I have a gift for you. Something fit only for the wise. Thank you. A means for circumventing the draw of the two fingers. Give it a try, won't you? And if it please you, may we meet again. Awesome. I have high okay. hopes for you, my lambkin. Yeah, I know how multiplayer works. Be sure to try that finger I gave you. There's no re tarnish. Your yeah, okay. Alright, Vary, I got my ass handed to me like five different times, so uh, can I join your cult? Oh, lambkin. So pleased you're here. I'm glad that you're enjoying my gift. I really wasn't. Mm. I knew it from the very start. You have a taste for noble blood. <clears throat> I wish to anoint you a proper inductee. A knight to serve Luminary Moog, the Lord of Blood, and establish a new dynasty. Luminary Moog has strength, vision, and of course, love. So, what do you say? my lambkin sure yeah hmm yes who would have it any other way now take this all right for your final trial soak the cloth with a maiden's blood Normally, this ritual would involve killing one's own maiden and recanting the wisdom of the two fingers. But since you are maidenless, the blood of anyone's maiden will do. Fantastical. I want to go find me a maiden somehow. And there of uh, Melania, uh, of Melina, would be interested in just giving me her period blood. So I grabbed the key from up the hill, and this key will take me to the start of the game. And from the start of the game, I can get some blood.
Let's go kill the Scion. He buffs up his weapon. There we go. Got me the period blood. All right, Vare, I got the period blood. What are we gonna do now? Ah, my lambkin. You've completed your final trial. And with this, you are a formal inductee. A knight who will assist Luminary Moog, the Lord of Blood, in the establishment of a new dynasty. Now, give me your finger. This noble blood will be an immutable badge of honor once it settles inside of you. Ugh, I mean, I kind of don't like the sound of that, but sure, I mean, I don't mind a good old fingering. Oh, sorry, I saw my gauntlets on. Ah! 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 Oh, good heavens. Clench your teeth or something. <laughs> Never forget that feeling of agony, for it is what binds you to Luminary Moog, to all of us. <laughs> you have the sweetest scream, my lambkin. Oh man, my eyes are red now. Not sure if you guys can really see it that well. Hold up. Lamp! Yeah, ugh. That look like a crackhead. Or a vampire. Or a vampiric crackhead. Oh god, the horrors. Oh, another thing. You should have this. Thank you. A medal granted by the new Moguin dynasty. With the power to grant audience with Luminary Moog, I've gone out of my way to provide one to you. But you mustn't use it just yet. Oh my. Don't mind if I do. Let's grab that. Ugh, this place is spooky. I now must get to a uh, bonfire, I mean a sight of grace. Yeah, a sight of grace. I think the sight of grace I need to get to is like over here. I still have this in my inventory, yeah. Okay, so even if I do die and lose, oh yeah, here. Yeah, there we go. Alright, so that's where I'm gonna call it, go ahead and call it here. Uh, so we got to Mogwin Pal Palace and we made some pretty good progress. You know, we, we got our weapons upgraded to a decent uh, level. I got the, uh, un strong enough to wield the Dragon Fist. Well, I mean, the, the, the fate part. But hey, you know, uh, small steps. Uh, I'm mainly going for our strength build anyway. And we got the, uh, the best fist whip in the game, which is those balls, which are pretty rad. So I hope you guys enjoyed this part of Elden Ring. I actually really did. I actually 
really am happy to record again. So I'll see you guys in the next one.